Hey, hey, Snix here, and today we're finally back with another episode. Again. And also, I'm hungry. I should probably go fix that. Juicy pork sandwich. <laughs> so, anyways, sorry it always takes me so long to upload. I'm planning on doing better in the future, but right now I'm kinda lazy. But in this episode, I for once have a plan. Well, most of my episodes do have a plan, it's just that I don't really follow them according to plan, because something always goes wrong. Pork chop. But, uh, but I'm sure I can stick to the plan this episode. First of all, I shall venture out. Uh, I'll do this at the end of the episode. But first I shall venture out, out there, because I have an idea, and... I, I don't really want to build it near here, because, yeah, because... Okay, I can't really think of a good reason to why I want to do that, but j j just give me a break. Cue the travel montage. Some trees! I've actually been here before. I came here off camera a really long time ago to get some red flowers. But this... This wasn't here! Oh, I didn't think I was ever going to get to properly experience this update. I love these trees! This is so good! But that's not the reason why I came here. I came out here... Cause of this fella. Yeah. Now, as much as I'm excited about the cherry blossoms, I have other plans for this episode. You see this place? This is a meadow. I, I think it is anyways. And you know what I'm gonna call it? Chicken meadow. Cause if you didn't know, which you probably don't, chickens are my favorite Minecraft mob. And, and it's getting late, so I must sleep. I will go to bed with my chicken by my side. Sleep. First of all, I'm gonna need some white wool, which, surprisingly, there are white sheep here for me to snip. Have a cheerful day. Why, thank you. I love those achievements. Snip. Now, I should probably explain what I'm doing. Let's just say this is what I'm doing. Oh, these petals. Oh, they look so good. Oh, oh, oh. Wow. Uh, but enough of getting distracted by pretty leaves. Like, honestly, though, these are the best trees I've ever seen in Minecraft. I love them, and I want them, and I want them to build with, I guess. I just realize I'm getting sidetracked again. Anyways, I am building a hundred chicken statues. Not like this, though. This is just a prototype because I don't have the materials to build one right now, but uh, you get the point. I did not bring any wheat with me, though, which is probably gonna be a problem because I need a lot of sheep for this. And don't ask why I'm building a hundred chicken statues. I'm just doing it because I can. Because I love chickens! Honestly, they're the best mob in Minecraft. Number one in my book. This is gonna be my biggest project ever, though. It's gonna take so many materials. And also, where did he run off? I looked for him everywhere and couldn't find him earlier. And now he's just showing up, I guess. 
Well, you're gonna come with me and get in the hole, buddy. You are one of many chickens I will conquer over my time in this world. And that's why I'm dressed up as a chick or a duck or whatever this is. I just have a love for chickens. They're so pretty and amazing and I love them and love them and love them. The sun's already setting again. Very slowly, though. Well, first hand of business, I am going to be needing a crafting table so that I can, uh... What was I gonna do again? Oh, yes. Make a composter. There we go. Now you might be wondering why I even need a composter. Well... Let's just say... I'm gonna need some bone meal to get some wheat so I can get some sheep so I can sleep. And I only said so I can sleep so it'd rhyme at the end. Because I can already sleep. Or not. Sleep. But basically, I'm gonna get some bone meal. One. So that I can get white dye. Two. So that I can plant some seeds. Use some bone meal. Get some wheat. And then I'll have sheep. And then... Why does it take me so long to think of things to say? And then I'll build a hundred chickens. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Th that'll work. First of all, I'm gonna need some food. That solves my problems. Anyways, time to put the composter in motion. I'm gonna need a couple of flowers for this. Now, with a composter, you put... Stuff in it to get that stuff. And if you put enough stuff into it, hold on a second, you get this stuff. This stuff is bone meal. And you see this? This isn't gonna grow very fast on its own. But with this, it grows so much quicker. So yeah, that's basically my plan, and then I'm just gonna get some sheep into a pen or something. Now I just use this, and there's my wheat. Now I just stomp this, because I don't want a random plot of farmland just there. And my pork chops are done. Now I can finally replenish my hunger bars. And with this piece of wheat, the sheep can't resist me. You're mine, sheepy. Come on. Now I ha- I ha- Why can't I talk today? Now that I have a couple of sheep, I can build a pen. I'm out of wood. That means I get to use cherry blossom wood. Oh, the way the wood looks. The way the wood tastes. The way the wood smells. Well, I'm not able to taste or smell it, because, you know, it, it is just a video game, but... I, I still can technically taste it and smell it if I just think of what it would taste and smell like. Mmm. <laughs> Tastes good and smells good. Wow. Cherry log. Even the sapling's glorious. Look at that. Ah! I love this wood. Look at that. Oh, wow. I love it. How does it look stripped? I love it even more. I'm, I'm, I'm just mind blown right now. Never knew a wood could be this beautiful. And now it's raining, of course. Uh, way to intrude on my vibes. Uh, look at those fence poles. Where did the sheep go? I can hear them, but I don't see them. Ah, yes. There's one. It's getting pretty dark, though. Maybe I'm able to sleep. Okay, yeah. Good. I do not want it to be raining. It ruins the vibes of the cherry blossom trees. There's the other sheep. Now, where's the third? Don't see him anywhere. Oh, well. I'll make the pen now. Look at that. It's not going to be a very big pen because I don't have much of this for now. But it'll do. Come on, sheepies. Get in the pen. Come on. I am lagging really badly. No, don't you dare go around there. Yeah, that's it. 
Now stay in there, and I will shear them. Oh, and by the way, if you're confused why this sheep's yellow, that's because I died to sheep yellow. My next order of business is, is that I don't have any black dye, and the only way to get black dye is in there. Ah! Ah! Uh, no, uh, there wasn't a single squid in that pond. Uh, more sheep. An easy scoop of wool right there. Snip. And uh, out of the way. Snip. Now I just get the sheep up here. And now I just give them a little nudge into the crowded sheep pen. Easy peasy. Now I do this guy. Another easy peasy. This is where the sheep went. Seriously. Get out of there. And I guess you can get out of there too, random chicken I put in there for some reason. This guy never fails to follow me wherever I go. What trades do you have today? No, no, nothing I'd be interested. Plus, I don't have any emeralds for you, so... Yeah. Even more sheep. Wow, that's a lot. Well, these sheeps are going into the crowded sheep pen for now. <laughs> right after I give them all a good snip. Snip, uh, snippity, uh... Come back here! Snip! Now I will put all the sheep into this pen, and you can also get into the pen. Wow, it, it really is cramped in there. But I'm sorry, but I, there's nothing I'm gonna do about it. Sorry, guys. Sleep. I'll cut to when I find some black dye, which might not be for a while, because I am really useless at this game. So... I have the ink sacks. It actually wasn't that hard. There was like a lake over there. And it had like two squids in it. One dropped one ink sack and the other one dropped three. So I'm pretty set. I will dye two of the white ones black. And also I'm pretty sure these sheep cramping up in this pen's lagging out my game. So I'll fix that. And there. Now I just break these fence posts as soon as these sheep go my way. And now they have more room so they'll stop lagging up my game. Seriously, how is it nighttime already? Sheep, my shears are almost broken. I'm definitely gonna need a new pair after this. Snip, 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 snip. Now that I have the materials to do it, I can show you what the chicken's actually gonna look like. There. Nice and simple. Also, my shears broke while building that, so you better get the picture. So basically, I'll have a hundred of these chickens going across the lands. And these are only the first two. And also, I'm probably gonna keep these ones, because I kinda like to keep the sample of this guy having those two little cobblestone eyes. But now... I'm gonna need some iron, and I have no iron in my inventory. I think I found a cave somewhere over here. Oh yes, right here. It's really dark in this cave. I'll grab some coal. That's better. Now, I just need two pieces of iron. Nothing much. I get so nervous coming into caves like this. How is there no iron in here? And why is this going to the surface already? I've only been down for a tiny bit. Well, there better be some iron in here, or else I'm gonna go crazy. How is there no iron here? And I don't have any torches left, so it's super dark. How have I not stumbled across a tiny little ingot of iron. I don't see any iron back there, but the mobs sure do see me, so I guess I'm gonna have to fight them. And I forgot my shield at home, so it's not gonna be as easy. Why did my sword have to break? The next thing you know, my axe is gonna break, and then my pickaxe is gonna break, and I have nothing to defend myself with. 
Because all these mobs want to kill me. A piece of iron. Is that literally it? I can't see a thing. I bet there's more, but I can't see it. And there goes my pickaxe, of course. Well, at least I have some wood to craft a new pickaxe with. There we go. Now I have some durability to collect up this coal. And I'm able to see again. Finally, the last bit of iron I need. Oh, no! Oh, that scared me so badly! Where did that creeper come from? I am getting out here while the going is good. <sighs> and of course, it's becoming nighttime. Now all the mobs are gonna spawn and kill me. I have enough wool to craft another bed, though, so hopefully I can sleep fast enough before mobs spawn. Please, 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 please. Come on. Okay, I should be good. Ah. Back to the surface. That was one of the most stressful five minutes in my entire life. But it was all worth it to save a trip home. Although, to be honest, I sorta did the calculating for all the wool I need. And I'm gonna need like 30 stacks of wool. So that's fun. So I don't think these shears are gonna last very long. The first thing I want to do, though, is ready the land that I'm gonna be building on. And I did the calculations, and I'm gonna need about a 40 by 40 plot of land. And for that, I'm gonna need a lot of flat land, so I'm gonna need a lot of flat dirt. I'm thinking about the sentence I just said there, and I don't get how this dirt could be much flatter than normal dirt. I mean, there's not really a much of a difference there isn't, in fact. This is just normal dirt. I, I don't know why I said that. I'm just weird, I guess. Weird with my words by that, I mean. I mean, like, what I just said. It felt, like, weird, like... And I know for a fact what I just said was weird. So I'm kinda weird. So this is sort of an outline for a 40 by 40 plot. But I did the calculating and I'm pretty sure it has to be slightly bigger or smaller than that. I don't know. But I'll wait and see. Probably slightly bigger. I don't have very many materials, but let's see how far I make it with them. One and two. And I had to shear some of the sheep to get a little bit more materials. So I'm not doing too well. I'm gonna need a lot more wool. I can't believe for even a second I thought making a hundred chicken statues would be easy. Newsflash, it's not very easy. Not very easy at all. And the box I made's not even nearly big enough. And I did the calculations and I'm only about nine stacks of yellow wool just for the beaks and feet. What have I signed myself up for? Uh, oh, wait a second. I was wrong. I'm gonna need about 11 stacks for the beaks and feet. Sleep. And I made a fifth. So I sure have signed myself up for a nightmare. All time lapse getting the rest of the wool I need, I guess. That's gonna be one long time lapse. Well, here we go. <laughs> Finally, the time lapse is done. You guys only saw a fraction of the time lapse, so if I had recorded the whole thing, it probably would have been a 10 minute long time lapse. I spent forever and I got all the wool I need. Look at all that. And I flattened some of the land. And as you saw in this time lapse, I moved my sheep to another sheep pen. It's even 
bigger. Look at this. But anyways, I might as well time lapse finishing the rest of this land. So, we. Now that's done, I think it's time I put all these materials to good use. One, two, three, four. Wait a huh? second. These guys aren't even equal. Heh. <sighs> I'll give this counting stuff another chance. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm done with these little baby numbers. Now I'm gonna count by tens. 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. And finally, 100. I'm finally done. That was only a few seconds for you guys, but that was an hour for me. Look at all these chickens. It's glorious. So what have I achieved in this episode? Uh, not very much, but I did build a hundred chickens. And I guess that really isn't achieving much. But I did find cherry blossom wood, so that's good. Sheep. And I also built that sheep pen. It looks so cute if I planted like a tree in the middle right here. Let's see. Oh, I need to see that from afar. Look at all those chickens. Wow, I've really outdone myself. Oh, that's so cute. And also, I will add a little bit of bone meal up here. Looking pretty nice. And now I have to go back to my house. Reverse travel montage. Ah, back home. It was nice having a change of scenery for an episode, but it's good to be back. And the last episode has one thumb up. That means I get one more block to work with. Probably won't be using that block for anything anytime soon, though. Anyways, before I end this episode, last episode, I forgot to say the say of the day. So the say of the day for today is... Don't forget your says of the days. The say of the day. But anyways... Thanks for watching me build a hundred chicken statues. It was quite a struggle for me, but I had fun in the end. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!